and welcome. It's Jilly Cube and Jilly, Jilly not Gilly <laughs> Cube. And I'm here on the Sunshine Coast in Queensland, Australia, wishing you good people, happy and safe life, and let's um, let's create something. Hey, I'm still on a buzz from the weekend that we had at our Valentine's. Um, huge collaboration with nine artists from around the world which is absolutely wonderful to be included with such brilliant talent i'm very happy about that and they are such gorgeous wonderful talented funny people and that's my kind of people so i'm um kind of gonna do i'm just gonna you know go with the flow literally go with the flow and just do whatever my heart desires today as I go along. I'm not on a, um, you know, I haven't got anything in mind. I'm just going to pour. But I am pouring with these Prism Pour Ultra Metallics. Absolutely so delicious colours. Look at this. So I have these sent me from Capriole Shabby Chic. They have them in stock in Australia. And they come from the Colour Art, I think the name is Leslie from Colour Art in the US. So um, I have given these a go with um, resin. So I've put them in resin because it says that uses are for canvas, wood, metal, glass, acrylic pouring, epoxy fluid projects. So I did add them to resin and they turned out mwah, beautiful. So I'm giving them a go on this pour today. So I'm using these and it says to only thin them with water and I have done that. But of course, I just have to try and add a little bit of the Aussie uh, liquid gold, the Aussie Floetrol. Just added a little bit of Floetrol to them. So uh, there's no silicon or anything else. So I just wanted to see what I get actually. So I will just let you sit back and relax and go with the flow so this is my just it's just um the this is global acrylic white mixed with um pouring medium is in the drop down box underneath this video and it will show you exactly what i uh, mixed my base coat with so and um, this is my little offset spatula which was just from the cake uh, part in uh, my local um, spotlight store like a homeware store and I've just found this wonderful for spreading so I'm not sure if the lovely Capriole Shabby Chic the family run business will have these in stock or get them in stock for you people because they're so easy uh, having an offset spatula to do little projects with and I, I thought this might be really nice to do kind of a ninja swipe with these this kind of spatula also so you know just trying things see what works best what works best and I'll give you an honest opinion if I don't like something I will tell you <laughs> so um, I do try all sorts of paint brands and makes I'm happy to try anything as long as um, I can give an honest opinion on them. So, so, what am I gonna do? I might turn this around and I might see what I can do with, okay, which one's this one? I think this is the, the red, the pink is a hot orchid. This is Cy, Salon Simonon, 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 I can't say it. You know what I mean, you know what I mean. I'm gonna put a little bed, I think, and see how I go. I think I might try and blow these out. They're quite thin, but not too thin. So I will just see. And you know, if I don't like how they're turning out, I'll just work with it. So kind of don't stress about it. And this is the metallic gold. This one is a global paint, so I've got the mix of the global and the um, 
prism 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 not prison prism and look at this wowzers trousers that is the most gorgeous gorgeous color out lovely just lovely oh doesn't that look like peacock oh i should do a peacock peacock paw now this is the hot orchid this is looking good oh my goodness i don't want to do anything to it those colors are just bees knees together look at that wow okay this is a bronze what what should definitely occur in this is lots of sparkle because just look at it it is gorgeous 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 a bit more of the guild i'm hoping when i blow these that they don't go muddy and i completely um wreck the look the only thing i'm going to drop on the top this is a little bit of the Amsterdam. I mix black and the blue together, so to make it like quite navy. So I just want to put a bit of the Amsterdam. This has got Floetrol in it also. So I'm hoping to, you know, get some cells without or lacing, but without uh, silicone or anything else. So we will stop. Oh never mind never mind let's see what we get i don't mind putting plenty on because i can blow it out let's see what we get might just start off with my heat wand get rid of any air bubbles Now I'm going to get my dryer. I'm trying to think if I can tape this end off to be a little bit finer. Um, kind of, I think that the end blowy bit is too too um, wide and it sort of, you know, goes AWOL. I'm just going to see if I can just put a bit of tape on there to try and reduce the, the blow hole the blowhole so let's give this a go I don't know it might completely stuff it up but oh it, it helps if you plug your dryer in oh, okay, no. here we go let's see oh, scary Oh my goodness, the colours, I don't know if you're getting this. Oh, I'm excited, they're gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at that colour that's actually still under there. This is why I don't like blowing the white over the colour because I just think it dilutes the colour. But. I am super duper happy with that. Look at that. Oh my goodness. 
goodness. I could do some stems on that now. Um, just let me, what can I use? Let me try this. Just gonna get my skewer. Let me just see if I can put some detail in here. Like, maybe around the bottom. Probably would be more beneficial, I suppose, to let it dry. Um, just embellishing it a bit. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Loving it. Loving it. Loving it. Yeah, that's gone a bit icky. That can always be scraped off, so I'm not going to stress about that at all. I think that is a flipping stunner. When that dries, that will be so beautiful. Okay, I'll just go over it with my... Absolutely happy with that. Happy, happy, happy Jen. I think it's just going to absolutely shine. I'm happy with that. Let me know what you think, guys. I just think it is a stunner. Absolutely gorgeous. I will put the photos on at the end and you let me know what you think. And as usual, I'll be back again tomorrow. So if you haven't already subscribed and you'd like to do so, because it's absolutely free, hit that subscription button and the notification. And I, a bell, because I put videos up every day and try to do a mixed bag of different types of pores. Plus I try to use all sorts of products so you guys get a... Um, a look at what's available for your for your choices but this is soft and delicate and it's a stunner even if i do say so myself so take care my lovelies and i will be back tomorrow bye for now